Welcome! Today is the first ever Lean Squad how-to cooking video. I've never done this before. This is the first ever one, and I'm super excited because we are cooking a lean, extra lean, coconut curry. Now, I'm sure you've had coconut curry before, but I promise you, it'll never taste it as good as this is gonna taste and be as lean as this is gonna be. So what is a lean coconut curry? Well, it's aromas, it's spices, it's chicken, it's tasty, leanness, all in one pot. So we've got our chicken, our red Thai curry paste, light coconut cream, a little bit of coriander, ginger, cauliflower rice, that's gonna keep it extra lean, salt and pepper, cilantro, garlic, onion, lime, shredded carrots, spinach, and coconut oil. All right, now it's time to make the leanness happen. Before we do that, we gotta chop up the ingredients. So you bust out the knife, and you get ready. Chop up the chicken, onion, and garlic. What I love about the yellow onion is that it caramelizes really well when you cook it. Um, it's sharp and spicy, and it's gonna add a ton of flavor. All right, step number two is, well, we're still chopping, this time garlic. So it's up to you how much you use. I love garlic. It's also cold season, flu season, so extra garlic is only gonna help improve your immune system. Woo! The chicken! It's chicken time, so we're gonna go with the chicken breasts. We're just gonna pop them down, oh, boop, and then I'm gonna cut them into about an inch by inch. Uh, little blocks there, little chunks, chicken chunks, lean chunks, whatever you want to call it. Boom, just get it going there. And this is key protein for our dish. Lean step number three is we throw it all in the pan. Coconut oil, yellow onion, chicken, and then just low to medium heat, five minute, we're gonna saute them. And this is really gonna soften up the onions. Bring out the flavors, let the coconut oil seep into the onions, and this is what is gonna make it really, really flavorful. I'm adding five cloves of garlic, but again, it's up to you. Now it's time to add the light coconut milk. We just pour it all over there. Oh, wow, look at the leanness. Spread it around, get excited, and then next we're going the Thai red curry paste. Get that in there. Again, you can play with it. Don't ever think you can't mix and match. Shredded carrots. I'm literally gonna pop these in there, mix them around, salt and pepper, again, play with it here. Don't worry too much about the salt levels. If you are exercising, you have no worries about the salt. You're gonna be hydrating throughout the day. Don't worry about it. Now it's time for the limey leanness. I just cut a half a lime in here and I'm just squeezing it in, not too much, but again, this is a little unique. It helps really bring out those flavors. It's gonna make it really taste really, really good. And then also, we got the spinach because it's nutrient dense. It's got that greenness, it's leanness. Always remember that, never forget it. In the pan, let them kind of wilt them away with the heat, the heat will wilt them. Coconut curry nearly done. Last step is to make it extra lean. We're going with cauliflower rice. Trust me, it tastes so good. It's a really good substitute for normal rice and obviously has basically zero carbs, whereas normal rice is very carb dense. It's heavy on the body. It spikes the insulin. This is not the case because we're making a lean curry. So all you gotta do is add a little bit of coconut oil to the pan, put in your cauliflower rice, mix it around for five to 10 minutes on medium-ish heat, and you will have the base of our lean coconut curry. Ah, the leanness is ready. I am so excited. It honestly smells amazing. I cannot wait to eat this. So we got our lean cauliflower rice all cooked up, and then the star of the show here, the coconut curry. Only took 15, 20 minutes to make. And now, we're gonna see how good it is. Oh my God, it tastes so good. Oh, wow, this is exciting, people. Fifteen to twenty minutes to make the leanest possible curry in the whole planet. This 
is why eating lean is so good because it still tastes amazing. I'm really excited about this one. Please, please, please give it a go. Comment. I'm going to be doing a whole lot more recipes in 2019. So make sure you subscribe to Lean Squad TV and eat the leanness. Live the lean dream. See you guys later.